Good morning, staff. Accent will begin in exactly one minute. Hello and welcome to WHS Has Talent. Today, we're going to watch our judges find WHS biggest star. Meet our judges, Camden Brenner, Haley Martin, and Brandon Thompson. First up, Austin Jackowitz. Hi, I'm Austin, and I'm going to sing you a song. What the? You, you seem like a really charismatic guy, but you're... Your guitar playing was subpar. It's a no for me. You say I'm not talented! Ah! I hate you people! Uh, we're having technical difficulties at the moment. We'll be back in just a moment. Okay, next up is Race Gardner with his beautiful music styling. Hi, my name is Race, and I'll be singing you guys happy birthday in my special singing voice. Okay, three, two. Happy birthday to me! Happy birthday to me! What? I, I wasn't done. Look, I really loved your enthusiasm, but I don't think this competition is for you. Who hurt you? Wait, I know. It's me. Get out! And last for today, we have a comedian. Meet Chris Chipman. Hi, I'm Chris Chipman and I'm a comedian. Man, I hate this class of people. So what's your joke? Me. I, I am the joke. Hi, and welcome to your accent for Monday, April 10th. I'm Chris Anthony, here with Haley Martin. Let's get it started. 10 second trivia. In what field are the terms strike, exposition, and proscenium commonly used? Theater, medicine, mixed martial arts, or construction? These terms are most often used in and around the theater, the proscenium relating to a common type of stage. Founded in 1997, No Limits Theater Group, like its name suggests, wasn't limited to people simply performing in plays. The actors were all students with hearing loss, and since then, the No Limits Group has produced 100 plays in 13 states and includes three education centers. Its founder is a CNN hero who wants to give all students the tools to do well in life. A child with a hearing loss can achieve anything. When you grow up, what do you want to be? I want to be a successful businessman. Hearing loss does not impact your intellect, but unfortunately, some of our kids fall through the cracks. Sometimes these kids are bullied, and a lot of people in their life tell them that they can't do things. Are you ready for your speech? Let's practice up on here. Their parents are often told that their child's never going to learn to speak. My third grade teacher called my mother. She said he can't do anything by himself. 
Mama thought that I hurt Clarkin. For the kids that are from low-income families, they haven't received a lot of early intervention. They get to us at four or five years old and they don't know their name. All right, let's work on your homework. Our organization works with children with all different degrees of hearing loss. Speak louder, have a big energy, go. My favorite subject is reading. We offer a free program to allow kids to have the education that they deserve. Welcome to No Limit, believe it or not. We started with the theater company. And then I decided I wanted to start an educational center really helping families in poverty. Mark We're filling in all the language, the grammar, and also teaching him how to read and write. When I grow up, I want to become an artist. I can do it! <laughs> oh, that was so good! Every 10 weeks, we have a graduation ceremony. And the kids write a speech, and then they do it in front of a lot of people. <laughs> when you see the parents in the audience, they're thinking, oh my gosh, What's going to come out? I have a big sister named Mommy and my mother about her. And then they see that their kids are just so brilliant and people are laughing at their jokes and clapping for them. It's, oh my gosh, my child's going to be okay. I had experienced failure because of my talent loss. But it cannot defeat me, I say aloud. I get to eat. Every single child here has potential and it is our job to pull it out of them and open as many doors so they can shine. These are my girls. Juniors and seniors, the guidance office is offering a field trip to Kent State Stark tomorrow if you are interested in going. Please see Ms. Stafford in the guidance office today for a permission form. Are you interested in auditioning for this year's talent show? Auditions will be held this Wednesday and Thursday, April 12th and 13th during all lunch mods in the auxiliary gym and also after school in room D217 from 2.30 to 3.30. All school appropriate acts are welcome. All proceeds from the talent show will benefit the Masculine Women's Shelter. Bring your best this Wednesday or Thursday. See you there. Looking for a summer job? Stop down in the guidance office to view summer job opportunities. The Holston Scholarship is available to seniors who are academically successful and exhibit financial need. Applications are due by May 1st. Visit the guidance office to pick up your application now. Today's lunch is a cheeseburger, baked beans, fries, and mixed fruit. Happy birthday to Robert Bennett, James Catterall, Chris Catterall, Juan Silverio Castro, and our very own Nate Soley. Well, that was all for your accent. I'm Haley, here with Chris. We'll see you on Wednesday.